This here, is, this here is one of my favorite exercises, what I call cats and dogs. You're on your hands and your knees, and there's a couple of things right here. He's going to go, first of all, into a dog position. There's two major things. He, what he's going to do is contract the shoulder blades together and lift his head, and automatically his lumbar spine basically arches, and he's got three stretch across the lumbar, the thoracic spine, and also in the neck. These muscles contract, and you want to hold this position for about five seconds, and from this position you go into what's a cat position. Basically, the lumbar spine comes up, looks, his head tucks in, and his, his thoracic spine stretches out like a cat, just like a cat would, and basically you get this nice gentle stretch across there. Five seconds from that, and then he's going to go back into the dog position, pulling these shoulders blades together, lifting your head into this arch through here. Now watch this as he goes into the cat position. Every part of the spine is being moved from the neck, middle part of the spine, and lower back, and going into the dog position again. Okay, so I want you to do this 10 times back from cats and dogs, holding each position for about three to five second hold. The longer the hold, the better it will be, but it's a great exercise to get the rhythm back from the lower back and also into your neck, and also the stiffness right through the middle of the spine where everybody complains about from sitting all day and standing all day.